I'm going to do a um, response to uh, some comments I got about uh, whether or not I land a Bonanza too fast or too high. A um, video I did uh, a while back with a buddy in his V35, the comment was made that uh, uh, we were typical Bonanza pilots and uh, land our Bonanzas like uh, 707 airliners. So um, I thought I'd do this video on, uh, went over a lot of my landings, but I, I pulled the last uh, video that I put together and just did some multi-camera things and uh, show the airspeeds and uh, how I land the Bonanza and why I do that. Uh, and uh, by the book, if you look at if you look at the uh, POH on my airplane, the airplane's full stall, dirty landing speed is about 56 knots. Uh, and if you take you know the typical numbers that people use, 1.3, that puts you at uh, about seven, a little over 70 knots or whatever uh, for an approach speed. I fly the airplane in quite a bit faster than that. And the reason I do that is it's hostile terrain all around my airport and most of the ones I'm landing in. Uh, and this video, you can see how quickly uh, the Bonanza slows down and comes down when it loses power. The reason I do that is if I were to lose power in my uh, approach process, I want to have some extra speed and some extra altitude to use. Uh, to get myself safely on the ground again. That's my strategy. There are plenty of people out there that would say there's no need to do that. Um, and you're welcome to fly your bonanza any way you want, but this is how I do mine. Here's the video. I hope you guys enjoy. Okay, we're picking up the video here on the downwind leg. I'm a little, I'm just crossing through 120 knots there, which is the gear down speed on the aircraft. Dropping the gear. You'll see I'm also uh, trimming for the adjustment. I'm actually adding a little power now because of the added drag. Uh, we are right at 1,000 feet above the deck at this point. So positioning for the base turn now also adjusting power i'm at my target speed of 95 knots that i use pretty much through the entire approach uh, <clears throat> all right putting in some flaps now about half of my available range adjusting for that uh, change in attitude we're power setting, trim, finishing up the gumps check, getting the mixture and the prop in the right position, and uh, working the throttle, basically. Now we'll start the base turn. Down to about... 600 feet above the deck and descending roughly 500 feet per minute and still maintaining roughly 95 knots. Now as I'm leveling off on to final you'll notice I'm coming over roads, trailer park, uh, a river, trees, houses, a lot of stuff that uh, I need to clear before I put the airplane on the ground. <clears throat> As the airplane gets into, uh, begins to pick up ground effect and stuff, you'll see it come right across the threshold. I'll drop to 80 knots at that point, begin my flare about 75 knots, and the airplane touches down a little over 60 knots. Runway's 2,500 feet long. I'll get it slowed down and turned around before I'm halfway down the runway. That's how I land my Bonanza. Yeah, I could do it a lot slower. If you guys think that uh, it'd be a good idea to land the airplane 15 or 18 knots slower than that in that environment, I'd like to hear it. So let's 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 let the comments fly. See you guys later.